Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Dama and today I'm going to be showing you what I got at Ulta. Surprisingly, during the VIB sale at Sephora, Ulta decided to roll up a 20% off for anybody that subscribed to their rewards program. And of course, I had to take advantage of this sale and I got some many products. So I'm gonna show you today what I got. So be sure to like, subscribe, and let's get started. So to start things off, I'm gonna be talking about skincare. Right now, I never tried any products from Derma E and I got two of them today. I got the Derma E Essentials Radiance Glow Face Oils with Jojoba, Argan, and Seagull Torn Oils. That will help me with hydration, anti-aging, and radiance in the skin. It's a really good purchase for the amount that it brings. It's a 2 point ounces bottle for about $16, I guess it was. And I heard so many good things, like you can mix it with your foundation, you can apply it to your skin directly. I apply a little bit in my hand and I noticed it soaked it up really good and quick and it's not oily at all. So I'm gonna, I'm looking forward to try this. And also the Derma E Microbration Scrub with citrus oil blends and dead sea salt. That is, it is said that it will help me with my fine lines. It will help me with acne scarring and again, radiance to the skin. So I'm really looking forward to try these two products from Derma E. I never tried anything from them and I always hear everybody talking about them so I'm really curious so I took advantage of this sale to try them out. Okay, so believe it or not, I'm such a late bloomer guys, I only tried two products from this brand before and they're two lipsticks. So I finally caved in and got myself the MAC Prep and Prime Fix Plus Spray and in the original scent, I know they have different ones, but I was scared, so I just got the original one. And everybody, everybody, YouTube, Instagram, uh, even just walking through the mall, they're talking about this product. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna try it out, see what's all the buzz about. I know I applied a little bit before I started the video. I mean, I need to try it out more to see if I see any change, but I know it's really good for when you're applying foil shadows. So I'm really looking forward to trying this product and see how it works with full shadows, with foundations, and other different products. So this next product, I never ever have tried anything from them because at least in Puerto Rico, we don't get their products here. So I ordered the talked about, like raved about in YouTube. Makeup Revolution Conceal and Define Full Coverage Concealer and Contour. I got it in C5. It's this concealer right here. Apparently it's something really good, like almost shape tape levels for what I heard. So I'm really looking forward to trying it. I just hope the shade actually matches with me. But yeah, uh, I actually don't know much about the brand. And I'm really, really looking forward to trying this one. So now, I'm going to show you a couple of products that I got from BH Cosmetics. BH has been a brand that actually I've used since I started with makeup. I remember the first products I bought were their 120, I guess, I think it was, I don't know. The big eyeshadow palettes that brought two floors. I actually got them all and it takes me to Brazil palettes and they were my favorite and I still use them eyeshadows ever. And I always stick to BH with their makeup brushes and eyeshadows. I never ventured for trying other stuff. So I decided to get the BH Liquid Foundation in Naturally Flawless. This shade, I don't even know. What shade did I get? I don't know. Is that, is that my shade? I don't know. Guys, I really, really don't remember what shade I got. So I'm gonna open this up. Okay, so. I got it in the color Ivory Beige. I hope it actually matches. Uh, I heard good things and BH has great reviews on their website from this foundation so I'm really looking forward to trying them out. I also got from them their Studio Pro Total Coverage Concealers. I got two of them. 
I got the color. Guys, by the way, I don't have my eyeglasses on, so I'm kind of blind at this moment. Okay, I got the color 106 and the color white. Uh, 106 obviously is going to be for my under eyes. Sometimes I use concealer to cover the little veins in my eyelids. So I'm going to test that out there. And also I got the white color because I want to see if it's good as an eyeshadow base. And white will help me pop more color in my eyeshadow. So I'm really looking forward to trying this. But the product that I'm most excited from BH that I got in this purchase actually uh, I saw many YouTubers get it and I was like, I want it, but I don't think I'm gonna get it until I saw Rob Beauty Christie, who is like my favorite YouTuber. I always see her videos, she uploads something, I go to her, I keep watching her Twitter, it's like, I'm Rob Beauty Christie obsessed on YouTube. So I had to get the BH Weekend Festival palette when she said she was in love with it. And I got it. I really like the packaging. It's really colorful. I'm really all about colors. And it's an eyeshadow palette with 20 color shadows, obviously. It brings mattes and also some shimmer. Mostly it's a shimmer palette from what I'm seeing. It brings one, two, three, four, five, six matte shadows. And then everything else is foiled. But it's a really, really good color palette. Everybody that has been using it has been saying it's an amazing eyeshadow palette. The colors are bright, they're great for blending, and really, it's BH Cosmetics. I never had any products from them till this moment that I didn't like. So I'm really happy that I got this palette. And I'm really looking forward to trying all of this out from them. I'm still gonna get some new products that I really want to try from them, venture more into BH Cosmetics, not only their shadows and their brushes. And who knows, probably I'll do an individual video about BH. So be on the watch for that. And the last product I got from this Ulta purchase is the Morphe 6 Piece Brush Set with Rose Gold Case. I actually only started using Morphe since recently that I went to Orlando. I actually got the Morphe and Jacqueline Hill palette and I really liked it because I never use Morphe because their tubing to Puerto Rico is actually quite high. It's like apparently, for what I remember last time I checked, it was about $10, $15 to $20 to ship to Puerto Rico. So that's why I never tried them until recently I went to Orlando and got some stuff from them. But I really saw this and I wanted to buy it when I went to Orlando, but I bought so much makeup, I couldn't take anything else. So I didn't get it, I was kind of bummed out, but now I'm happy because I got it and with a 20% off. So I love the case, it's really long, so the brushes are not going to go bending inside. The brushes look amazing, I'm just going to take them out of the plastic. It brings actually one pencil brush brings two blending brushes right here. two blending brushes right here it brings one flat brush that I actually love them to carve out my brows and also to clean up the liner line it brings one packer at brush and also one liner brush I'm not gonna take it out of the protective case because it actually is really pointy and I don't want to bend it accidentally but I'm leaking Really, I'm really, <laughs> but I'm really looking forward to trying this eyeshadow brushes. I always hear amazing things from Mor Morphe brushes, so yeah, I need to try this out, and I'll let you guys know in the next video. So that's it for this haul video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any of these products or are going to try any, let me know in the comment section below. Also, be sure to like and subscribe. I'll see you around in the next video.